Oh gang, Storm's in the kitchen. Gonna have a little lunch here. Uh, actually gonna have a tomato sandwich. I know I've done one video on tomato sandwiches in the past. Onion and, no, that wasn't onion tomato, was it? Anyway, I've seen this video of this guy he made a tomato sandwich and he used a whole tomato on one sandwich, which I, 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 I don't do. I usually like two slices. But I decided I'm gonna use the whole tomato. And this is gonna be on rye bread. I don't know how many people like rye bread. Everybody's taste buds is different. For me, when I eat a tomato sandwich, I like to have a lot of mayonnaise because I like it nice and juicy. So I'm gonna put mayonnaise on both sides. I hope this turns out because I'm trying another tripod that I bought at the thrift store. <coughs> Mrs. Stump is having some of her egg salad, which is pretty good in itself. Put mayonnaise on both sides of the bread. There. And take these tomatoes. This tomato cost me, I think, a dollar thirty-seven. Two big old slices, and you got four slices of this. As you can see, I did save a couple of small slices for uh, hamburgers this weekend. Hopefully, put two tomatoes. I'm going to add two pieces of cheese, so cheese goes with everything. Yeah. Let me put some pepper on here. Well, i put it on the bread, that's what I'll do. Uh, put two pieces of cheese. Let me see that bowl of egg salad there a minute. I'm going to show you all. What's left? That's what's left. We ate some yesterday, but that right there looks pretty good, don't it? And trust me, it tastes good. And I'm gonna add a little bit of, let me get the pepper first. Put the pepper on this side of the sandwich. Gonna space out a little bit of the mayor here. I mean the onion. And a few twigs of bell pepper. <laughs> Freshly cut. Basically, it's a garden salad sandwich. She says, Mrs. Stump says it's a garden salad sandwich. <laughs> but that's what it looks like. Certainly looks good. Now, if I can fold this thing, let's see. You know, we're going to do this and not make a mess. Flip that little baby over. That's what you call a tomato sandwich. So I cut it in half. Probably tear it up because you got it when you got it. Yep. The piece. I agree. I have some of my food line, mountain line, because they've been out of they've been out of ginger ale except for the diet ginger ale for the last two weeks. I got this. I've had it before, the first couple of times you use it, it tastes like kerosene, and then you get used to it. So, it's not that bad. I tell y'all, look at them tomatoes stacked up. I've been planting this for a week or so. Ever since I've seen that guy, and that guy loved it, stacked up like that, so we're gonna try it too. That's good. Mm. 
Be another made of come from food line. It tastes good and fresh. Onions taste fresh. The rye gives it a little bit of a different taste than on regular bread. Up. It's good to have a good tomato -y taste. It's a lot better this way than this too. Even though it's a lot of tomato. Really good. Y'all can see that. That mayonnaise, once you get into it, it gets mixed up. And all this good food in it is really good. I have some onions and bell pepper that I'm on, that I've already got chopped up. It's gonna mix it up in some ground beef patties. It's gonna take the Rye bread, gonna make some uh, uh, yeah. patty melts. But I don't plan on taping that. Probably gonna do that Friday. I might take it, but right now I don't plan on it. But we'll see. The bell pepper is good on this. You don't want to use a whole lot of bell pepper, but it's good on here. Mountain line from Food Line, I think it's supposed to taste like Mountain Dew. And I'm not sure it does. It kind of tastes like Mountain Dew's little cousin from Northern Alabama. But that's a joke. I might want to try this. Get you a good tomato and slice it into four thick pieces. Fix it however you like it. It's good this way, but getting kind of messy toward the end, but man, it tastes good. Mm -hmm. Well, we're approaching 10 minutes, so We'll end this one. Appreciate all y'all watching. All y'all that have subscribed, appreciate that. Try to watch as much of these videos as you can so I can get the views. I will be doing a video on the new Oreo, Star Wars Oreo, Star Wars Oreo cookies. So y'all look for that. Until then, 
stump. We'll see y'all on the flip side. Check y'all later. Whoops. Come on. Uh oh. There we go. Come on.